let's say what is the neutron so neutron so is a platform which prepare you for career in tech it has a many courses designed for freshers and workers professionals and also for a woman who is no tech background neutron so first trains you for 6 months and help you to become an amazing stack developer it also has a network of more than 300 great company to hire from newton school so once the training is completed newton school ensure that its student are placed with some of the best companies in the country and the best part of this newton school has a pay after placement program under which you do not have to pay newton school anything until and unless you have placed with a minimum 5 lakh ctc let's have a look at newton school launch pad launch pad is a institute taken by newton school for people who want to start coding from scratch and learn the basics different programming languages for activity free of cost the video would be available in the launch pad sections of the newton school there you can participate several quiz and assignment related to this course so guys in this video we are going to create the pop up chat box using html css and javascript like this when you click on this icon it will be open a pop up chat window like this we can close it by clicking on the close button and open it on clicking on this let's create this. so here is the simple html boiler plate so first of all we will add the heading if you want you can add this heading or if you not want you can not add it so now we will add the button tag class of this button tag will be open button So I now I pasted the link of uh, my image. Let's close this button tag and add div tag. The class of this div tag will be chat pop up. and id of this will be my phone inside this we will add the prompt tag class of this prompt tag will be form container inside this we will add the h1 tag Let's close this H1 tag and add the label tag for message for message. You can add any content over here. And now I will add the text area. class of the text area will be eh m place holder will be type message and name will be msg and it is required Now we close the our text area tag. So 
so now we will add the two button now one for submit to send the our text and one is to close the pop up form so we will add the one button type type of this will be submit and class will be btn means button and text will be same let's add the another peer button tag type of this button tag will be button and uh, class of this will be button cancel because this button we are going to use to close this up power box one click close form the text on button will be close and let's close the button tag and now we will close the our from tag so here our html code is ready let's take a look at our css till now this is the our output so now let's take a look at our css first of all we will use your universal selector and make the padding 0 and also margin 0 and box sizing border box so we are going to use the pop-in fonts inside the our pop-up chat window so we will use the google font we are going to open fonts for that click here We are going to add this size font so copy this whole link and paste this link inside the our head tag and here add the body and let's paste the our second CSS code over here background color of the our body will be background color of body will be hashtag so now we will style the our class open button background background color of this will be hashtag and box shadow will be R G B A 
right? It will be 20 pixels. Border radius will be 20 pixels. Plus open button image. We will size the our image. Height of the our image will be 14 pixels. Plus the chat pop up class display none position fixed and bottom will be zero right will be 10 pixels and Z index will be 9. Let's style the our from container. Next, next width will be 300 pixels. and background color will be white border radius will be 10 pixels and margin margin bottom will be 15 pixels box shadow will be RGBA zero pixels two pixel eight pixel and zero pixel container text area width will be Hundred percent padding will be fifteen per fifteen pixels. And margin will be five pixels. Zero twenty two pixel and zero. Border will be none. Background will be F1. and tree sizing none. Also, minimum height is 200 pixels and border radius will be 5 pixels and margin. Top will be 20 pixels. So now we style the text area when it get focused from container text area focused. Background color will be and outline will be none let's style the our send button from container and button background color will be asterisk 61 b1 5a you can add any color that you want color will be white and fading will be 16 pixels and 20 pixels
border will be none cursor will be pointer and width will be 100 percent margin bottom will be 10 percent and opacity will be 0.8 20 pixels so now we will add the red color to the our cancel button Now we will add the some hover effect. Opacity is 1. So now our CSS code is ready. So here is your CSS code output. So now we will add the JavaScript in our code function open form. get element id the id will be my form dot style display dot display is equal to block let's add the another function let's add the another function function close form element by id the id is my form dot style dot display equal to none When we click on this icon, a pop-up form is opening, chat box form is opening. Thank you for watching this video.